Rapid Media presents Rapid Media TV. Sweet. All right. Scott, <laughs> Scott McGregor here, the Rapid Media TV, drinking a beer with Shane Benedict from Liquid Logic. We're at Outdoor Retailer Summer Market 2011. And Shane, you were just telling me about a new camp, or not a new campaign, a campaign that you did that led to the development of your new creek boat, the Stomper. Why don't you tell me a bit first about the campaign and how that came about, and then I guess we'll get into the boat. Right on, right on. Well, um, we started a campaign this winter, sort of late in the fall, um, called Automatic for the People. It's kind of a long story how, where that comes from, but uh, basically it means we're going to do it for you right now. And um, on our Facebook page, we presented the questions, you know, what do you want us to do? What, what boat design do you want us to do? What improvements to the line? You know, what, what would you like Liquid Logic to do? And um, we had hundreds and hundreds of responses to the questions and different ideas and thoughts. I mean, we got everything from colors to, you know, make a 25 foot racing, you know, kayak, whatever. A C1, we got it barraged by C1 requests. <laughs> you know, it wasn't me. I mean, it, <laughs> yeah. it could have been me, but it wasn't me. But uh, it was actually a really fun process and we got to see all these people and their, their real passions for different ideas and different concepts. And the number one thing that people wanted was a flat hauled creek boat. And, uh, and in black. <laughs> exactly. Well, they wanted a flat hulled creek boat, you know, from Liquid Logic because you got you could put the badass outfitting and all that stuff and the real durability and the good build and all that stuff. But they wanted a flat hull, and uh, man, I got, I got threads after threads after threads of exactly how to build it. And this is the culmination of that. You know, we had uh, the Stomper. You know, it's a same sizing as the Hefe's. Um, eight foot two and eight foot six in length, uh, 80 gallons and 90 gallons. Um, and sort of the design is in a way a meshing of the remix and the Hefe. You know, the speed, um, the ease of use, the rollability, stability of a remix with the bomber build, the, the, the heritage of Liquid Logic, you know, that's always had a good creek boat in the line and, and bonding those two together and making the offspring, <laughs> you know, the, uh, the stomper. All right. So uh, what else is different? What? So the the main difference is, is, well, I mean, the deck, people mistake it all the time for the Hefe. And in, while we were prototyping, that was very convenient. We could drive right by people, and they wouldn't know the difference. Right. Um, I, think I, I think I met up with you guys. Yeah. <laughs> do you remember right. that? I do remember yeah. that. Okay, and so uh, the main difference is just putting a flatter hull in with a little bit lower rocker profile in the stern so that it carries speed a little better. but a really nice big rocker in the front so it'd get up and over things. Um, and that, you know, that flat platform just gives you the ability to spin on a dime and then also pick up speed and get going really quickly. And that's kind of the general characteristics of a flat hull boat. It gives you those, those qualities. And most of today's boaters are, have learned there <laughs> and they don't want to go back to a displacement hull. Or at yeah. least that's, that's how it seems. Well, there is, there's all those people that have learned that way and they like that style, and the crazy thing is, we still have the Hefe. You know, one of the most, you know, traveled creek boat designs of all time, and it's still selling great. So now we've got the opportunity to say, you want a displacement boat, you got a Hefe. You want a flat hull boat, you got a Stomper. You got the two options. Great. So these look like production boats to me. So when can we get a Stomper? Stomper 80s are shipping now, and Stomper 90s are shipping in a couple of weeks. Um, so they'll be. They should be in in stores if they've ordered them, and uh, by the end of the month, no problem. We've got a riverboat shootout coming up. Uh, we're going to do this fall for a spring issue of Rapid, so I'm going to get you to send me one of these at the office. Awesome. There is a couple of other things I'd like to show real quickly, if possible. Uh, all right, be quick. Let's go. Okay, outfitting. Right. Check it out. You got to check it out. Big. This is a big deal. This was also automatic for the people. Make it easier to get into the back of the stomper. Get into the back of the stomper, no problem. Flip it back, and then also another attachment point in the front, carabiners. The new outfitting goes in all the boats across the board. So even the Remix now has a rotor molded seat. The Hefe gets a new rotor molded seat with better access to the back in all of our boats. New stuff for everything, all the way across the board. It? Automatic for the people. <laughs> Automatic for the people. <laughs> Scott Happy Hour at uh, Outdoor Retail Show. It's pretty awesome. We're going to the Paddle Zone for beer. This is Scott McGregor with Shane Benedict from Liquid Logic. Rapid Media TV, helping you paddle forever. <laughs> That's good. Learn more about Rapid Media's print and digital magazines 
International Paddling Film Festival, on-water events, and online store. Visit rapidmedia.com.